penicillin allergy. A lot of people tell me they have it, and they go into great detail. You're not even sure they have it. What could you tell someone if you think you have it? What you could do to protect yourself from getting a severe reaction? Penicillin allergy is certainly an allergy that many people think they have. However, when you do very careful analysis based on history, exam, as well as testing to some extent, we find that less than 10% of patients who think they have penicillin allergy truly have the allergy. The most common misconception is that a patient who has a respiratory infection is started on penicillin and then develops a rash automatically has penicillin allergy. Many respiratory infections have a rash as part of their disease. Some respiratory infections develop a rash once they're exposed to penicillin where that repeat exposure to penicillin with a different infection will not cause a rash. That is an interaction between the infection and the antibiotic and has nothing to do with a true allergic reaction. In order to identify an allergic reaction what we need to do is look carefully for certain specific symptoms. First, the skin rash needs to occur either within the first 48 hours of the dose or roughly 7 to 10 days after the medication was started. Second, the rash has to be hives. That is, it is a rash where the rash is elevated from the basic skin level not flat to the skin. Third, it must be itchy. In order for a rash to truly be allergic in nature, it must be itchy. If the rash is there but the patient is not uncomfortable, isn't pruritic, isn't itchy, it is not an allergic reaction.